fourth and final main topic today. And really, I'm going to be honest with you. This was like the only thing that I felt was even movie worthy of talking about news. Uh, but yeah, hey, like I said, I, I, I wanted to find some things for us to talk about. So we talked about some streaming release dates and, and an Evil Dead teaser trailer. But Gladiator 2, um, Ridley Scott is currently developing it and is looking for lead actors. And we have this article coming to us from the guys over at Screen Rant that says more than 22 years after the release of his original film, development on Gladiator 2 is now ramping up with director Ridley Scott reportedly looking for lead actors. After the first Gladiator, which stars Russell Crowe as Maximus, a soldier turned slave who fights to get revenge for slaying up for the slaying of his family proved popular a sequel has struggled to get off the ground one script for the project apparently featured maximus being reincarnated as a warrior at different points throughout history but the film never came to fruition in late 2021 however scott revealed that a new script for gladiator 2 had been completed and that he planned on directing it now, more than a year after Scott revealed that Gladiator 2 script is complete, a new report from Puck News reveals that direct the director is looking to cast lead actors for the sequel. Other details regarding the project, such as its plot or whether Crow will return, remain unknown. But the latest report is a promising step toward the film actually entering production. Despite Scott's apparently apparent enthusiasm for Gladiator 2, the momentum seemingly building the movie has yet to officially get the green light. Uh... Let's read on a little bit more. Although Scott may be looking to cast the project, there's still no guarantee that Gladi Gladiator 2 actually goes to camera this year. In addition to the fact that the sequel hasn't yet been given the green light, it's not clear whether Scott has the time in his schedule just yet. Um, the director is currently in post-production on Napoleon, his historical biopic starring Joaquin Phoenix as the titular, whoa, that's awesome, French emperor. But he's also attached to direct and executive produce a new series called Sinking Spring. On top of Sinking Spring, Scott is also attached to Queen and Country, an action thriller currently in the early stages of development. Despite being attached to several projects, including another untitled Alien prequel, it's certainly possible The Gladiator 2 will take precedence for Scott. Unfortunately, the report that Scott is looking for lead actor, actors doesn't clarify whether Crow will be returning. Um, obviously, Max, Maximus may have died at the end of the movie, but it's possible that the actor will be brought back in the sequel. Yeah, da, 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 for sure. I, I think uh, this is big news for Gladiator fans out there, right? Uh, this is a step forward. At least we know Ridley Scott wants to. He's got a script. Script's done. That's huge. Uh, and he wants to direct it. That's good. Rid Ridley Scott has become very hit and miss, right? Obviously, Alien is, you know, one of the greatest movies ever made, in my per personal opinion. Uh, and then, you know, you, yeah, you just, he's got, then you got like Alien Covenant and stuff like that that he's done recently. Um, not that long ago, he had his first Academy Award win with The Martian, which was uh, spectacular. So, Real hit and miss, but hey, he's the guy that did the original, so you trust him with the second. He's got the script done. This seems like it's moving forward. This is this is exciting news. This is, um, like I said, if you're a fan of the original Gladiator, to be honest with you guys, I haven't seen that movie since I was probably like 10 or 12 years old. Um, so it's been a lot, but I remember like, oh, you know, of course, as a young boy, I remember loving that thing. Um, who didn't want to be a gladiator? Uh, but yeah, so uh, if, if, if you're a real big fan of this, then you're probably, this is exciting news for you. And it, you know what? I would see this. I would check this out if directed by Ridley Scott. If he goes through with it and he directs this movie, I, it doesn't have to be Russell Crowe. Honestly, the coolest thing of this whole article was hearing that there was an idea that Maximus comes back as different warriors over time. That would be the way to go. 
Um, you could do different races, different um, ethnicities, uh, uh, different, you know, a whole different kinds of people. And that would be really cool to see, you know, to see Michael B. Jordan play Maximus in like the first act. And then to see, you know, maybe Russell Crowe again in the second act or in the third act and see another one in the second act. I mean, that would be really cool to see, uh, you know, all these different reincarnations of Maximus, the, the, the gladiator, you know, the warrior. Um, that would be awesome. I would, I, I think I would dig that a lot. Um, obviously, that's not the script that they went with. And for some reason, they thought not a great idea. But whatever. Hey, at least, like I said, we have some news on Gladiator 2. Um, it's moving forward. It, you know, it's if, if this gets released and happens at the soonest, this would be like 2025, 2026. You know, so this is still a long way away, uh, but again, it is a step forward, a step in the right direction to getting this sequel finally to, to a movie that's, you know, I can't remember, 22 years old. I mean, that's ridiculous. That's crazy uh, for how successful it was. So, but what do you guys think? Are you guys big Gladiator fans? Have you always wanted a Gladiator 2? Maybe you think Gladiator 2 shouldn't be made. Definitely let me know your thoughts down in the comment section below.